Tell me, what was it like growing up? You grew up in an Amish country? So I wasn't Amish, but all our neighbors were. Okay. And so it was, it was kind of cool. Like, I grew up, I got the best of both worlds. Like, I had a car, my neighbors didn't, you know? Um, so we were like, horse and buggies, like, they didn't have electricity. Um, so it was, it was very interesting, because it was like a completely different culture and an old-timey thing that mm -hmm. I got to experience that a lot of people don't. And you left home at 15. I did. Was I that difficult? It was. Um, so at 15, I realized I was gay. And I knew that coming out of my hometown was not an option. But I also knew that wearing that face, that mask, every single day right. of being a different person was, you know, suicide, unfortunately, is the highest rate of killing in oh. LGBTQ youth, highest rate of death. And so I knew I got, had to get out. I yes. knew I had to get out there and be my true self. So I went to the big town of Springfield, Missouri. I got out. Um, and then fast forward to 21, I went to New York City. And now you've won five Emmys for your show. <laughs> I mean, come on! What do you say to children that feel like they don't belong? What's your advice to them? You know, I. My advice to them is that you you do. Just because you may not belong in the moment that you're in, you will find that moment. You know, I didn't belong where I grew up. I remember we would go into this restaurant by our farm growing up. Yes. I just see, did you hear my accent came back out when I, I said hear that? It. <laughs> and the old farmers would be like, well, you don't belong here. You belong in New York City or something. And I was like, I don't know what New York City is, but I think you're right. Um, you <laughs> you know? Know. No, I was like five, Aww. you know, I was five. Um, and so in that moment, I did not belong, and I never felt like I belonged where I grew up, but I do now. Yes. And you know, I, I, it's like a pretty woman, big mistake, huge, you know? <laughs> so uh, to those people who feel like they don't belong, you know what, everybody feels like that as a child. Yes. Even sometimes the most popular kids mm -hmm. deep inside feel like they don't belong, because you know, maybe they're hiding who they are, but you will, you will find your tribe, you right. will find your people, and you will belong. And you do belong, <laughs> and you do belong.